Hello world and welcome back to a reviews. So, ito yung nabili nating solar portable solar panel guys and kung napansin nyo, ito yung brand nya Flash Fish Flash Fish So, yung brand nya is Flash Fish and we got this one from Lazada So, there's a review also on this one ni Solar Miner PH you can search the channel and goods naman siya kaya bumili na rin ako so pag binuksan nyo to meron dito and yung kanyang panel kung saan ka pwede mag charge so ang maganda dito is type C enabled siya so may type C then meron ding USB interface and then yung AC do a connector yeah. so according dun sa specification this is 65 watts ang kaya yung output ng power delivery yung type C dito and itong solar and itong solar panel is 100 watt yung kaya yung generate so later to test natin and then may kasama sya ditong uh, cable for DC AC DC yun know? Uh, connector and then ito some ano user manual lang and 100 watt yung nakalagay and 100 watt so buksa lang natin para makita nyo so for ano siya apat na panels na naka fold which is very handy ayan so four panels siya Ayan. And uh, may kabigatan siya pero uh, okay lang naman, manageable siya pag dadali. And then kunin natin yung size para makita nyo. So ang size niya is I just sira na yung ano, tape measure. Ayan. So around 16 17 inch and and then yung height niya uh, simula sa ano uh, sa medyo ha older isara na na yeah simula diyan ah uh, bababa is sev almost 17 din no? so 17 by 17 so 17 by 17 siya tapos meron siya dito parang flap oh. and uh, ito yung stand niya pag nakabukas yung solar panel so later ta try natin pag maaraw and check natin kung uh, nakapag power delivery nga siya so, you can buy a power station wherein yung output nito is store nyo sa power station. Then, yung power station yung gagamitin nyo for uh, charging your device. Kasi, of course, pag nag-charge kayo, tapos uh, nawalan ng araw, syempre mawawala na yung na-harvest na power, no? So, you need a power station for this one. Uh, meron din si Flash Fish na power station, pero yung binili ko is other brand and Reviewin na lang natin pag dumating na. So, ito guys yung binilan ko na store. If you're looking for this item. Ayan, ito yung store niya. And, ito yung price na nakuha ko siya. So, can swipe. Ayan, 100 watts siya as you can see. Ayan. And, ayan. Ito yung makasama niya. Ito yung panel. Ayan. Yeah, okay. and that's it now. So the interface is there. So you can visit the store. So Flash Fish Power. Can miss me the name of the store? Yeah. So hello guys. Ito yung ating solar panel and currently maaraw. Uh, pag chinek nyo, maliwanag and nakabilad ng ating solar panel for our time now is uh, 
3.13 in the afternoon and we will be charging yung phone na to. So I'm using the type C uh, interface to charge our phone. So type C rin yung cable na gamit ko. The cable is OK um, 100 watt type C. So I'll just put the link below for uh, this cable. And currently yung charge ng phone natin is nasa 74% ayan ayan 74% siya so ikakabit na natin yung uh, charger natin uh, wait lang ayan so as you can see nag nakalagay is charging so nag charge yung ating cellphone and from 74% so fast charging naman tong phone pati yung cable uh, let's wait a certain minute kung magano agad sya no ayan so charging sya and wait lang tayo ng ilang minutes kung tataas sya so according dun sa nakalagay sa specs nito yung Type-C interface is up to 65 watts yung kaya niyang ibigay. However, sa mga reviews na nakita ko, yung iba is only around 60. So, I don't have the ano kasi, uh, device to measure yung wattage niya. Pero, ayan, check natin. No? So, 75 na siya after a certain uh, minute. So 3.15 Wait tayo ng siguro 5 minutes And tingnan natin kung uh, Gano'n tag katagal siya mag The percentage up no? So fast charging yung uh, Phone na to May capable siya mag fast charging Then yung cable na gamit natin is uh, 100 watts Then yung interface down Itong solar panel is 65 watts So if you're uh, using uh, interface and then 65 watts yung capacity nya dapat yung cable na gamit nyo is also same ng binibigay na wattage or higher so pag lower hindi nyo consume yung 65 watts so pag 65 watts yung interface dapat yung cable nyo capable na 65 and up since hindi nyo marireceive yung uh, power no, na ibibigay nya yeah. and then if your device can uh, kunyari for example yung device nyo 35 watts or 45 watts pag chinarge siya dapat yung charge sa papasok sa kanya is equal or higher so pag less than pwedeng masira kasi yung mga battery ninyo yeah. so if you're going to charge uh, iwan nyo na lang uh, huwag nyo gamitin pag ginagamit nyo sa nag charge siya then yung power na binibigay is less than uh, malaki yung chance na masira yung battery Ayan, so check natin so one after 1 minute uh, 76 76% siya. Ayun, so iwan ulit natin siya. Ayun. Ah, uh, post ko lang muna 'tong video since tayo na natin siya. So check lang natin, guys. Ayun. Ah, uh, kung ma-observe ninyo, ah, uh, yung phone natin is 3 minutes na nakalipas and then 78% na siya. And then pag napansin niyo sa babang part, and rapidly charging uh, wait ano yung natin yan ayan, kung nakikita nyo rapidly charging sya ayan so when say rapidly charging meaning mataas yung wattage na nakukuha nya so siguro nasa 16 na yung nakukuha natin from the solar panel so make sure uh, ma mainit or mataas yung araw pag ginamit nyo yung solar panel of course pag mababa yung uh, nakukuha nyang solar energy it might uh, give you less than ano lang no kung less than lang yung may bibigyan sa inyo na uh, power ayan So, we're almost done sa 5 minutes natin. And 79 na, no? So, from 74 kanina, no? Or 75. And so, naka... Oh, yun, 80% na. So, 5% na yung mga... Around 5 or 6% na. From... Uh, the start, no? Ayan. I think... Mag... Ano na ito 5 minutes. Ayan siya. Ayan, so after 5 minutes, naka 80% tayo from our um, 
solar panel. Uh, so ayun guys, um, after using it, siyempre sa solar solar panels yan no? ang init niya nung tinanggal natin after gamitin. And naka, kung napansin yun, nakapag-charge naman siya. So legit naman na uh, nakapag ano siya, a power delivery. Yan. So if you want to know more yung specific ng solar panel, and you have meron uh, testing si solar miner ph you can watch on that for specific but overall uh, i think this is a good buy and if you're planning to buy this um solar panel uh, i hope this video helped you now again this is 100 watts kasi meron ding other vari variant yung uh, panel na to. So I think that's all and thank you for watching.